Hi folks, Tim here again from High End Cheap Tech, and today I'm going to recommend a slightly newer set of the Elector D10s. These are really cool. they got a nice little latch on them. You have to hit a button here to open them, and uh, they slip right in the case, and they don't take long to charge up inside the case. You can get 24 total hours of use out of these, three recharges. Um, and on the back, they have a couple of LEDs flanking the micro USB charging port. And uh, it doesn't take long to charge the case and the earbuds totally back up. But I can use them for about a week. I don't use them that much. Uh, but let's get to the newer versions for only $7 more. Hi folks, Tim here just cutting in. Quick message about TubeBuddy.com, as you will see coming up on the screen right now. TubeBuddy is the premier tool for helping you edit and maintain your presence as a creator on YouTube. It integrates flawlessly. If you have a free version, uh, it goes right into your browser and you use it as you're you know, doing your editing and, uh, and uploading. And it, it's an excellent tool. Uh, as far as prices go, the price is coming up on the screen. Um, if you get the free version, a lot of times they'll offer you, uh, they'll make you an offer. They made me an offer and I'm only paying $4 and 50 cents a month. So check it out at the link that you're going to see on the screen and at the link below, uh, www.tubebuddy.com forward slash high-end cheap tech and now let's get back to that video we were doing all right folks i'm back we gotta run the tube buddy ad as usual um and uh i just want to point out that the uh the the elector d12s are only seven dollars more let's let's take a picture and put it up on the screen here for you so you can look at them yeah they come with a case with Really cool LEDs that show you on each side how what the charge on each earbud is. And these do not use the master-slave arrangement like on the D10s. The D10s you pair to the left side, and then it pairs to the right you know, when you pull them out of the case. Uh, if you want to use it, you can use them separately, but then you have to go in and repair or, you know, you can set up the pairing in advance uh, using the you know, D10-R uh, and use that one. But, it, you know, it involves switching connections. And these just come up as D12, and you can pull one out and drop it in. The controls are absolutely identical. They're, it, it is buttons, but you put your thumb behind your ear and press in, and it won't force the uh, earbuds into your ear. These are IPX5 rated, Bluetooth 5.0. Uh, let's check another picture here. and Here's a really cool thing coming up. Yeah. 2600 milliamp hour battery. 96 total hours. You can recharge your earbuds 16 times. If you're a major player with earbuds in your ear all day or maybe you just use them to make phone calls you have no microphones in each so you can take one out put it in the charging case and just leave one in your ear waiting for phone calls uh, I could only find one YouTube video on this but I went and read all the reviews and uh, um They're all positive, for the most part. I mean, there's always a negative Nelly out there who has to say something stupid and, you know, show their ignorance by going, This is nowhere near as good as my $300 Sony's. Really, no shit, genius? It's 39 bucks right now on Amazon. The link will be in the description below. Read that. And, you know, of course, I get a little kickback. Very little in a $32 purchase, maybe a dollar fifty. 
uh, not even, whatever, 4% of, yeah, whatever. Uh, but for $7 more, you get this coming up on the screen. Yeah, that is a killer feature here. Not only does it have that LED display that shows you, you know, that each device is charged and how much charging you have, you've got a 2,600 milliamp hour battery, folks. 96 total hours of playback time at about 80%. And uh, they use the same button layout and controls that my D10s do, so they'd be totally familiar to me. You know, two clicks on the right to go forward a track, two clicks on the back to go back a track, one click on either earbud to pause, whether it be a YouTube video or the music, and uh, you know, another click to restart, or three clicks on either one to reject a call, and I think it's five seconds on either one, and you can access your assistant. I, I can't tell you for sure how good the mic is. Uh, I Like I said, I only found one YouTube review on these. Uh, but these don't have that master-slave arrangement deal that the D10s did, so they'll just come up as D12, so you can pull one out and drop it back in the case, and you could probably, you know, if you got a 12-hour day coming up or a 10-hour flight, <coughs> you could sit there and listen through one, and when you're done with that, you pull it out and put the other one in, and it'll pair right up and connect. Uh, and... Uh, that's pretty cool. So, 96 hours of total playback due to that huge battery, 2,600 milliamp hours. You can charge your phone off this thing and use this power bank and get yourself an extra half hour out of your phone, maybe an hour if you've got a small battery. Uh, you're going to use up your earbud charge, but these charge off USB-C, uh, and they come with all the same stuff the D10s did, six sets of ear tips. Uh, they're going to come with the medium, kind of conical ones, the more traditional ones, and they have the squared off ones, which is what I use on my electric D10s, and I use the smallest ones. I really hate having stuff stuffed in my ear, but... They're great for taking naps. So, all that being said, for seven dollars more, I definitely pick these over the D10s. The link will be in the description below. The link will also be there for the uh, D10s if you still want to save a few bucks. Uh, they're worth your money, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, that's all I got to say. So uh, have a great day. Thanks for watching. And make sure you give us a thumbs up, like our channel, or like this video, and subscribe and leave a little feedback in the description below. Negative, positive, we don't care. And if you want to leave a thumbs down, that's okay too. Any kind of interaction works for us. Interaction is what YouTube looks at. So let's go to the outro and I'll throw a couple of videos up in the corners and we'll see you in the next one.